Hey there, Ospreys. Welcome to another edition of Inside Swoop at 90. This is Global News with Grace. I'm Grace Velez, and here's what's going on around the globe. Chinese President Xi Jinping met in Beijing with the two European presidents, Ursula von der Leyen from the EU Commission and Charles Mikel from the EU Council on Thursday. The EU is calling on China to improve market access to address an annual trade imbalance of more than $200 billion between the two sides. China is unhappy with the EU's restrictions on technology exports and an EU investigation into the subsides for electric vehicles. The EU has also urged China to use its influence with Russia to help bring an end to the Ukraine conflict. Von der Leyen said the two sides need to manage their differences responsibly. A gunman roamed the floors of a University of Nevada Las Vegas building, killing three people and critically wounding a fourth before dying in a shootout with police. The gunman in Wednesday's shooting was a professor who had unsuccessfully sought a job at the school. A law enforcement official with direct knowledge of the investigation told the Associated Press. The United States has offered strong support to Israel in its war against the Hamas militant group that rules the Gaza Strip, but the Allies are increasingly at odds over what will happen in Gaza once the war winds down. Israel's Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu this week announced that Israel would retain an open-ended security presence in Gaza. Israeli officials talk of imposing a buffer zone to keep Palestinians away from the Israeli border. Well, that's another edition of Global News with Grace with Inside Super 90. I'm Grace Velez, and I'll see you all next time.